Okay, so what we're going to do, we're just going to set up reason 4 with Cubase and wire them together so they're working in sync before we actually embark on a project. As you can see, I've opened up Cubase. And what I'm going to do now, I need to open up a new project, an empty project. Don't go for any of the presets, just go for empty project. Simple as. There we go. What I like to do now is with it, I like to add an audio track just to set that up, have that nicely slotted in there. Okay, then your top line here, go to devices, and you'll either have reason 3 or reason 4 installed. This, the way of doing this, it works with either 3 or 4. I've got reason 4. And we see we have a reason down in your list of devices. If you just click on that, and that'll bring up the rewire channel. And what you want to do, you want to click on Mix L or Mix R, either one. It'll automatically choose both for you, which is exactly what you want. And that's basically all the setting up in Cubase that you need to do right now. Okay, so that's there. We'll just open up Reason now. Okay. So there's Reason 4, Cubase in the background. And if we press play on Reason, you can see that it triggers Cubase and vice versa if we press play on Cubase lift up reason it's triggered reason so there we can be happy that they're wired and we can get on then start making some music 